today. I feel like I haven't seen you forever, but I am still here and I'm so excited to see you every single day, except the days that I'm super, extremely packed and busy. So, hey, welcome everyone to Glitter Sissy and Sus Light Tutorial. Hey, Mika, thank you so much. Always nice and bright and early. Um, and we just finished with unboxing. I closed my box and I'm going to write 11 21. Maybe Mika can help me. Can you get one 11 21 box? Maybe um, she can help me out with that. Um, I just need the the numbers 11 and then space like dot 21 okay. box on that. That'd be awesome because then I will save my box in every single box I have. So I have 11 box at the moment right now. So thank you so much for all of you know you for amazing love and support either you are with us from throughout the journey from almost four years ago or you are just tuning in welcome welcome to our platform i mean for our to our page for a lot of free tutorials nail art and also well recently is opened a storefront in pensacola so if you are here in town or closer you are more than welcome to come on in and enjoy with us with some like hands-on tip and trick questions you might have and um don't forget with the sub box don't be too excited which is i am going to is there's 100 subscribers will be receiving uh glitz e gift cards between 10 to 100 dollars of I don't know well right. the gift card the value so then you can able to go shop online on um no the price can gotcha. uh 24 7 on our official website okay so let moving on i have a lot of the items in here and i can't wait to use them i'm gonna put it on the side i'm gonna show you what i am going to use too but i'm so thrilled about a lot of things here is the um sky bling exclusive for this box and then the 40 gel you always ask for it and then precision glue gel so we ask for it we listen so let move that is beautiful box on this side and i'm going to show you how i create this look this is a gel on nail tip extension and just a little sneak peek first and then you want to see this special product launching really soon all right so let's get started so i have this is um the set already this is almonds long all right i'm sorry i take it back stiletto long and what it does is the tips is made of 100 percent gels and is really flexible it's already have a beige big coast in there so i'm not going to destroy it but i'm going to show you how uh, can you get me the box? Oh? The box uh still little long. Okay, so I'm not gonna mess up because this, I have the base gels in here already. But I'm gonna show you really quick because you think it's gonna be flimsy, but it's actually not. Um still little long. The tech glitz is a long time for a whole year to really, really work on this. And um the special about is is hold on this one you need to zoom in though it's no longer look at how special it made the formula is 100 percent gel soft gel and it's soaked off and when you bend it it will not making the mark at all which is mean that it gives a lot of flexibility and is really really rare that you're seeing is breaking or bending is so easy so is a great it looks like it's so flimsy but it's not it's so solid it's when you're weighing it on it's shocked absolutely and we can't wait to do is like a lot of tutorials for a lot of you who is really want to add additional the service in your service in your salons and also for all of diy now at home bam this is gonna be a game changer and it will last up good four weeks or even longer i wear that is quite a few months for a different shape and it was definitely the bomb i work in the warehouse and the showrooms i pack for the shows wrap all the palace uh set up uh breakdown none of them come up at all so 
let's get started with this and then i have here is really cool aurora gels collections and it's number 31s i believe i get this one from a subscription box back in september so two months before so if you miss it do not worry and if you're thumbs up if you want to see the auroras on the website because it was exclusive for the sub member so i did all of them already i did the base the bay gels and sorry i took it off i need to press it on Do you have a hot cover tips? Why do you use phone cover nails? So, Lucy, hot cover tip, you mean the, the tip for the extension for enhancement nails, you mean? I mean the tip for the enhancement nails. So, I already have the bay gels already and key for 10 seconds. I am going to apply the Aurora number 31. It's kind of a little bit of a natural, like a really light pink blush, I think. All right, here for 60 seconds. Do you have, so yes, we do have the tips, which is a tip for enhancement nails will be, is a little bit slightly different. And a lot of them that you see, uh, we have it on the website that is not recycled tips. It's also when you bend it, it's not easy to come up. Um, I have some of them right here. So those are different. Um, so those are for the enhancement nails. So this one that I just show you is for the press completely press on, okay? And then this one is the tips a little bit. If you're feeling it is compared, it's a little bit uh, more flexible and thinner, but it's actually is made from not recycling tip so what it does it give it really flexibility so this is the the extra long coffin this one for if you want to do with the velvety gels be on the top or if you want to do is a heart gel be on the top or if you are using a liquid can powder or a dipping powders uh, i mean liquid can powder using the monomer methods and liquid can powders uh i mean acrylics with the dipping methods so then you can get this. This is actually coffin long. You can definitely find it on websites and also is the I guess tip. So it's mean that it's not recycled tip. So you can see that how I ban it and how flexible it doesn't make a mark for you at all. That's as really is a game changer for a lot of you who want to extend it your clients now without have to worry about it. Hey, Samantha. Hi, Sammy. How are you? Can you put it back? I don't know what the number it is, but... All right. Are you ready? And I'm going to go ahead and using the matte top coat finish on that one. I just did all of them and it did one, so then we can save time and get right into the design. And we are going to do the matte top coat in here for 30 seconds. And we are going to using this beautiful two colors, Boarding Heart Neons and Fusioning Delight, okay? Piece of paper and crystal clear. That's all you need. Let's do this uh, together. So I'm going to do is give a little bit of shakes and then Burning Heart and then little shakes from a delight. And then we can add it on and we can create that look. For the nails that look so dramatic but actually i'm promised it's gonna be super simple and easy all right let's do this together i'm gonna do boop, 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 boop. just getting at just a little bit and you can do a whole set okay use this one you can do i'm going to do is like a half of the nails because we want to get enough space so then when you are using the gel tip extension on it's still able to penetrate and it's still able to cure uh, through the uh, gel tips. All right. Just one layer. If you want more, this is really cool that it's going to create is really something with the neon on the top of the Aurora. It looks like a um, uh, metallic like marbling. So delight, you can layer right on the top. You can do it on the sides, however you want. Wipe it off because I don't want to carry that is burning hearts back into my delight bottle. Wipe it up again. Continue to the next one. The thing is difficult, but it's just like in no time. 
So I am just want to create some background for this nails before we start doing a fun nail art using a subscription box. Um, fusioning is a, definitely is the way to go because it really it does add it on so much uh, definitions for the um, nails. All right, just follow with the um, looks. I mean, with the colors is burning hard, and I just lay them. And keep in mind, there's no right way or wrong ways when you do a fusioning. It will be come out with the different looks. I mean, different uh, veining. So that is how best about the uh, fusioning. It will never gonna be identical. If you look at uh, every pieces of the marble. None of them are identical. So just have fun and enjoy the process of it. So I'm going to do just pick just a little bit of a crystal clear. You don't want to saturate your brush so much. You just want the brush to be just enough. So then that way you can able to uh, guide it, your fusioning the way you want it and then create the veining you want the way you want it. And I'm going to do, I just tap, tap, tap along and outside toward to the middle to the center or wherever if you want your vein to be on the left on the right and then guide that to the left or to the right okay moving on the next one always brush your brush on the piece of paper to clean all the excess pigments so then that way you don't carry all these pigments back into your bottles because then that way it will keep your crystal clear just nice and clean again you see that literally that I don't have much of the uh, the um, crystal clears on it. Less is more. And just don't load a lot of them. Don't load your bristles too like soaking wet because it's going to blending everything. And it's going to mix thing is like you're going to destroy all them like the veining looks. All right, it's gonna it's gonna be so cool when we put the top coat on because it looks matte right now. Well, if you need to pick one color from a fusioning, I would suggest one color of whatever favorites you want. You just like play and check it out. Get what whatever color you want. Either you want to do is uh, neon or you want to do is like is um, traditional color. Get yourself the bestie, which is a matte top coat. Um, and then the bestie uh, crystal clear, you are good to go. If you have to pick ones of the uh, fusioning, you don't have to get a whole set to get started. Get one first and start playing with this. You'll see how easy and simple it will take your fun nail art to the next level. All right. So you see that? I Basically, my brush doesn't have much of it, but it has so much of a product for me to work. So now I'm going to pick my brush uh, the bristle ones get a little bit of a little bit of the crystal clear and i'm just tap tap a little bit to get some like a little bit of hint colors that's all i need i don't want to soaking like saturate this part hey are you still good there mm -hmm. and i am still in the camera mm -hmm. thanks to you because then we'll get the uh, tutorials video yes so for all of you just join us what we're working on is glitz fusioning. So you can mix and match any color you want, one color or ten color. All so right. What you doing is with two color. Yes, I did this two quick. color. I'm so excited about this. It's really cool. It's make it so far looking. All right. So that's it. If you are done, you are happy with this. You are going to put the top coat on if the clients are okay. That's it, Nancy. That's all I want. I want to spend like $20 for fusioning or $30 for a whole set. That's good. Top coat. If the clients want to spend additional $5 or fancier, you can add like a gel painting, the the little of um like veinings, golden touch. If they are not, then it's not going to be the end of the war. So you can top coat and then good to go. And but then the clients, oh, I want dramatics. I'm gonna have a Halloween party. Can you create something? Absolutely, you know. So we are going to moving on the Weaver Gel Jet Black. So I'm gonna create this really cool fun thing. Um, and you know that I always like I have a bunch of this. I show you how I create this. Just a Scott tape and then five toothpicks. Okay. So let's do this together. Are you done with this? And moving on the next one.
All right, next one, next techniques, the second layer on this. We are going to create some kind of a weaver, like spider web or whatever. So it looks like a little bit dramatic, but it looks super cute because the crystal is going to be on the top of it. I promise it's going to be so simple. All right, ready? Hold on. Let's pick one. Two. Can you see? Can everyone see? All right. Look at that, how cool it is. Ha ha. Super easy, right? All right, again, you'll make it look so fancy and it's just like, it's super easy. One, two, and three. Again, ready? You probably create the set in like half an hour. <laughs> I like it. All right, again, if you want your line to be thicker, you can definitely uh, pick the more weaver gel. If you want the line to be thinner, pick less weaver gel. That's all you need to do. Okay, moving on, the pinky. One, two, three, and then you are good to go. If you are like walking, you can definitely do this in a lunch break. Right, Mika? Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm doing it at lunch break. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Okay, I'll just wipe off my stand. It doesn't have to be anything with the nail. So, okay, happy? We are going to key this baby for a 60 seconds, but I'm going to do a 30 seconds because we are going to do a more crystal on it. You ready for crystal placement? All right, so if you follow with all the videos, okay, if you're using for the next hand, I mean, next, next half, I mean, another five tips, so you don't have to throw it away. If you're doing it for the uh, next five nails, you don't have to throw it away. But if you're doing next client, then I'll just suggest throw it away and using the new one. It's super easy, simple to make this one. And um, 30 seconds, and then we are moving on the crystal placement. What are we doing right here? And let's do some a spider. Do you want to see spider now? Okay, I'm going to do the spider. Let's do some different spider now. All right. Uh, where's spider at? Okay. Do, 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 right here. Okay. Yep. Like, so no spider broke the legs and arms, so they're still there. So it's great. All right. Let move some spider. I promise it's gonna be like really super quick. Okay, ready? Condensed glue gels. If you having troubleshootings with your crystal placement, your crystal placement will not listen to you, will not stay in one place, and it will just running everywhere. And it will even doesn't matter how much the crystal the glues that you put it on, and it's not stay, it's gonna stay by to you in like one day. You need this bestie. Or oh, no, this bestie needs you because it needs to be in your station and assist you with any of uh, crystal placement you might need. So, apply one coat. You see that how I spread it out with the bristle? You don't want to using a lot because it's unless you're using the 3D cluster crystal or 3D pointed crystal, however you call that. It's easier for you to call. Then you need more. But if you are doing a flat back, you don't need a whole lot. However, you don't want it using too little because too little is not going to adhere properly. Too thick, it's going to flood your crystal. So if you feel like your crystal running like crazy all over places, even like with the little smaller size, it means that you might use a little bit much. So in the next time, you can um, try a little bit less. And in a couple of times, you're definitely going to get a hang of it. So no wipe top coat. Floating right on the top. I'm missing everyone. I love to be back with another tutorials. All right. So floating on the top, you see that my bristle is not spreading crazy because I do not want to drag all my condensed blue gels away. So it's, uh, that's what I want. And I will have... Uh, we might have to check to see we have voice. Anyone can hear me with a voice on? Can Mika hear? Can you hear? 
All right. So Instagram, sorry, we are going to go back in just a second, okay? Just come right back with us. We're going to end the videos and then we are going to come right back. Just go to down road to Weaver. There you go. Keep your this going. All right. So, well, we're gonna wait for Instagram for just a second. Uh. Let's give it a second. No, All right. Talking. So we are going to is apply. Uh, oh, my God. Oh, I destroyed the web. So then now what happened if I hid in the web and all spider going to run off that and they're going to come and beat me. All right. Okay. Hi everyone, we're back again now. Sorry for the technical difficulty. I'm back right now. Look at that the nails. It's so cool, easy, simple. We are going to do a stunning nails. So I did with just a few minutes ago, I did using the condensed glue gel with really thick density. And I did a layer of the no wipe top coat right on the top. All right, so now we are starting. What is spider we are going to do? I should add. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I like them all. I'm thinking I have an eyes on the blue one, but what you think? This one, Mika has it. Mika, can we see your nails for a second? Come on over. Sure. Mika's right here. Hey, Dom, welcome back. Thank you so much for tuning back in. Let me see. Stay tuned. She's going to do some live. All right. So let's is uh, absolutely. Can you send hey, a message? Thank you, Lauren, for the batch. Thank you, Lauren, for the batch. Yeah, just send the message to Deep uh, We'll be ready talking a little bit. Um, okay, I don't know which one is that wanna do because I didn't have the answer. Uh, okay let do i have the red one on already i'm gonna do a different one i am going to do let's do some this one obsidians and red ah this is beautiful spider we're talking about that dom is terrified of the spider but me too and Guess what happened? So basically, I using the perfect drop, which is you can get it. It's like individual. You can get this one from uh, Insta Pack. It has six color, which is make sure is spider is so cool and stunning. All right, so I have the frame. If you remember it's earlier, I did cut and trim a lot of frame when i did it my nails so if your frame is not the length of the way you want you can do your a uh, spider legs longer shorter however you want and i just happen that have this one it uh, cutting in different lengths that i want all right more it's so simple right And you need to send a message. All right. Yeah, yeah, this is so, this is like sexy spider. It's not scared at all. It looks so adorable. 
All right, I miss one antler. Can I get one antler? Right here. Where's my frame? Um, this one. The whole tray. Where did you move the whole tray? Yeah. Past the tray. No, there's another tray. You right there. Don't tap in my back anymore, okay? All right, so I'm gonna add some of the glow in the dark. Hey, I like it. I'm just using the glow in the dark from a glow in the dark crystal kits, just few of them. And more. All right, happy with this? We're going to go ahead and key it for 60 seconds. Check, check, check. There's any. All right. So adjusting this, she's like, maybe she's like moving a little bit. All right, here. Ready? Here you go. Just 60 seconds. And then moving on the next one, I am going to using our Funkies, which is the 40 gels that we have. I just got it from my box, so I'm so excited. I can't wait. I'm going to show you how super easy it is. I'm going to move this beautiful a spiders, crystal spiders, and we are going to do more crystal spiders on the next set, which is tomorrow, featuring the Gliss subscription box, November sub box, and a lot of fun fall and Halloween designs, okay? So my box, where my box? Can I get my box back? Get it. I have my colors right here. I'm going to use this one. You know what? Maybe I should use this one. I think it's going to look so good with the nails I'm going to create. Funky. I'm going to show you how it's the easiest way on earth to do is 40 gels. I promise you are going to definitely rock this. So, Funky is like, have a really nice purple. It's perfect for this um, Halloween as well. So, the next nails. We are going to apply the no wipe top gold, okay? Let's do that one. This is like index and key only 30 seconds okay so no wipe top coat because that is a key to adhere your beautiful 40 gels on and in the meantime i'm gonna pick like a two smaller beads this is from my sub box so if you sub box have a different colors we always want what we don't have but i actually i think i love this colors I'm going to do two beads, one, have it for me, and because it's the index, so let me see, so one on this end, and another bead, the so same size. It's the best thing about 40 gel. You don't have to worry about it. If you feel like, oh my gosh, it's too much. The bead is too big. Don't worry. You are going to be able to remove it and put it back into your jar. Close it because I am going to start this um, like scrubbing it, however you want to say. And here is the keys. The uh dual 3d brush all right i'm going to 
is designed is special for our for glitz 40 gels and 5d gels all you need to do is get all the angles it's perfect for you already press it down press down release and then go to the wrap to turn to the left spread it to the left spread it to the right that's all you need don't have to go too aggressive you don't have to like move like press it too much you do not have to really gentle and then second one press it down in the centers like spread it on the left and then go to the right and give a little bit of the pressures doesn't have to be too aggressive okay and then that's all you create this super simple and then i also did that with my is um sunflowers as well that's all you need how simple it is Ta -da. that's it all right flash gear quick 10 seconds and then we're going go ahead and using condensed school gels and i'm going to show you how i am getting my frame so I'm gonna get the frame for my favorite kit. I have to say, literally, my favorite kit. If you haven't get chance to take a look on this one, this is still available. It sold out twice a few times. So we are going to have. Um, I mean, it's still on the website. So it's the best thing about it is it has a lot of frames for me to work with, and I never get um, run out of the frames and the charm. So I am going to using condensed glue gels. Again, if you are having really difficulty troubleshootings with the crystal placement, this is going to be the bomb. It's going to be your bestie, I mean, on the desk. Uh, you can have your regular bestie and then the bestie at your station. So I'm going to apply the whole entire condensed glue gels, okay, on the nails. And again, not too thick, not too thin. And hold on, let me add a little bit more so right here on the angle. Did I move it close, too close? Just let me know. Okay. And close this. You don't want it to be accidentally here and no web top coat. I'm so excited with my uh, 40 gels. Um, some of you, a lot of you will get your like a goldens or um, yellow sun or high, uh, high noon. And all like neutral, white, a black. Oh my gosh. Is it 27 colors in the subscription box? So you will get a lot of you will get the same, a lot of you will get different. Because Gliss believes that is that way is can kind of able to unleash your potential so you can create it so many more. All right, I'm then putting this one on. Okay. And where am I? Okay. all right so here is still is glow in the docks crystal that i got it for my um for my subscription box i'm so excited and then i'm gonna put the center p of this one right there and here you go some frame again I'm going to add it on next to the flower. This is super adorable flowers. And then it's like it takes you, what, literally two minutes to make it. Frame. To make it look like, a, what does it call that? Steam or whatever you want to call that. Looking for the smallest one on earth. You know what? Remember, if you can't find the link, the link that's your frame you want, just cut it, okay? Do not frustrate it. I'm going to cut it. I'm going to have ask you to help me cut it. Um, can you cut it in like a smaller? In the meantime, I'm getting a different one. I can't, I'm so unpatient, like not patient at all. Okay, so I just talked to myself. You have it can you put it in the that's right here right here thank you thank you babe. and i'm gonna add small glow in the dark you know what it's gonna be cool because it still have cute flowers and then guess what happened it's gonna glow in the dark Ta -da. all right that's it
That's all you need to do, and it take you like two minutes. Wow, not including is curing time, but that's all you need. Okay, cure for sixty seconds. But I'm when you're doing only one nail, make sure you cure for thirty uh, sixty second full cure. But because I'm doing other designs coming up, so I'm cure for thirty second, just for your information, so you don't like feel like it's thirty thirty second because we wanna keep curing it in a little bit. All right, moving on the next nails, and we are going to do the schools and no, the pumpkins and the skeleton hand. So, I have my really cool charms collection. For if you had the um subscription mark last month, which is October, and then a lot of you will still have the uh October box shipping out because you sub it yesterday. And there are a lot of cool uh, charms in there. So I'm going to take this one out of that. Um, what one of my, this, but also you can still get this by itself. Um, but I'm going to using the skeleton hand. I'm going to move it here so it won't break. And then one of my pumpkin. All right. Ready? Next one. Let's go. This one is my subscription box item. So I'm going to put it in my box so I won't forget, okay? And let's start with the condensed glue gels. Everything with the crystal placement start with condensed glue gel. So just make sure you don't forget that because in that way, it will keep all of your crystals and your chain charms stay in one place. I go ahead and put the is one layer of the condensed glue gel first. And then follow along with the no wipe top coat. Okay. And place that. Uh, it looks like this pumpkin is not creepy at all. It's like at least that it ha it's showing like, hey, I'm happy. All right. And we'll place that right there. Flash key for 30 seconds. And then again, start with condensed glue gels again. So with this, you're doing it for yourself. It's going to be so cool and stunning. If you are doing it for clients, then you can able to get it, you know, like upsell your services and add it more for your appointment without spending like two, three, four, five hours to doing that. So next one, I'm going to apply the condensed glue gel. Sorry, pumpkin. I'm going to do it a little bit because I need it right on the face of the pumpkin. And then just uh, I just I just apply the uh, condensed glue gel and then no wipe top coat. I try to show all the products just in case you are watching it at nighttime when your kids going to bed. You don't want to bother anyone. At least you still see that what I am what I'm using, so it won't confuse you. Okay. So okay, next we are going to get the super. I don't know. I think it looks cute though. It's not look creepy. I, I can't deal with like. It's a nail art. It looks so cool. It's not that creepy. Okay, look. She or he grab perfect on that pumpkin face. Oops, sorry, it's not keying yet. So you can use a flash key first because sometimes your clients, oh, Nancy is so pretty, and then they move so much to the point that the pumpkin falling off. So you just get it and then flash key it again. Look at that. She's poking her eyes perfectly because she's like. You on the mean pumpkins. I'm going to poke your eyes. All right. Go back with condensed glue gels. It's super simple. Don't think it too overwhelm. Just like make it simple. But I do each step. So then that way you can follow each step. And then it's just going to be like this. And it's stay on. This one had the school. This one had the pumpkins. Spider. All right, now we're going to do whole nails. I'm so excited today. You know what? I couldn't sleep because I wanted to do it for you, this design. I don't know. It's weird. So today I can sleep well. <laughs> and then tomorrow I'm going to do another design for you. And I won't sleep if I don't show you because I'm so excited for this season. 
And I hope you all enjoy and really having fun. And for all of you on nail techs that really want to do a lot of cool, fun designs without frustrated and stressful about this, it's going to be for you. So I'm even like, you can even coat this, okay? Charm, you can coat it, but don't coat it on the top of the crystal like this. I do not coat. But you can coat in the charms and the frame. It is okay, not on the crystal because you don't want to destroy the crystal sparkle and shines and everything else. So, well, I'll add just a couple of the glow in the dark crystal again with my tray here. Um, I take it out because I don't want to open the my tray so many times because I might accidentally is my spill it so i know myself so well so i put it in there okay add some pizza you can add some pizza on is that easy i don't know how long that take if you video it and how long you think each nail is like two minutes five minutes As long as it doesn't take five hours, we'll be fine. All right, in there. And then we're going to give her, like, him. And, like, it's really cool. Big one right there. That's one. Maybe, well, maybe we should do it, like, right there. And put beats on it. You know, a lot of you will ask where is the best uh, place to put the beads just right between your frame and the charm and between your crystal and crystal and between your crystal and the frame and charms. Just make sure they are connect tight together. You don't want your crystal to be in the north and your beads is down to the south. You know, you want them to be next to each other. So then it's created this really cool like kind of, a, of a channels. So then they are not only stay on really cool and tight but then also it's gonna look really cool uh like a like a more like a jewelry look right good how everybody doing i feel everybody quiet oh it's just me talking too much here for 60 seconds you happy with this we're going to here for 60 seconds all right And I'm gonna add one of this. I'm gonna show you how I do this. It's super simple and easy. This one will have a score ready, so I'm gonna add this one from my subscription box. So I'm so excited. Who going to get uh, what colors? I'm gonna use this one to my. Let's see what I have. I have the frame matching with that though. The frame matching with this one. Okay. Ah, there's a lot in there. I'm not going to spill it. I'm going to close. Okay. Look. Stunning, stunning, stunning. All right. So let's do uh, one of this ones for... What is it called? This leaf, though. I forgot the name of this one. Does anyone know this? <gasps> I just drop it. It's okay. I can pick it up later. What is the leaf? I totally it start from the K. So to to um encapsulate to apply this one is really simple. I'm using premium Iho Chanfer Foy and uplines on tie the nails. You can apply exactly where you are going to place the leaf, but I'm gonna do the whole nails because then that way I can choose place that I'm gonna do here for 30 seconds. Ah, thank you so much. Design by cell. Like, make spider less creepy. That is awesome. Okay. Okay, so then now we already have the premium IHO. Chan for foisons. I'm going ahead and pick up this one. 
when will you the premium I hope and transfer for it? You use it because it's got a really good grip. So you can use it not just for transfer foil, but for encapsulate, sound like this one too. Mm -hmm. This is what I got. This is what I got in my uh, sub box. I'm excited to see what other. And then look at that, it's staying nice and flat right on the nails. There you go. And then you can add more crystal on it. Should I do crystal in that one? I'm going to do crystal in that one. And if you're happy with this, we are going to cap it with the condensed glue gels. And then we'll start doing a crystal placement. Okay. And it's really cool because it's not only in cap, the leaves also is going to, oh, this one, it just didn't press it down. And it also is going to adhere the crystal at the same time. And don't forget, no wipe top coat. All right. And put it right, the frame right there. And then this little, it's kind of, um, it's cool, like, um, I'll explain that, it's more scent. More of, um, like of an onyx, but it's not onyx. It's really cool, though. And, like, cat eyes. This look like. But anyway, when you have it on your hand, you will know exactly what I'm talking about. In the sub box. I am adding some crystal on. All right, being really good. Add some beads on. More beads on. You don't have to, but if you want to add some on, absolutely. It's really make is the finish looks so much better. I'm going to add a couple right there on the edges. And then we are ready to go. Is how everyone doing, though? Everybody okay following along? Mm -hmm. You can always be watching them and then fast forwards as well. All right. Happy with this. We're going to cure for 60 seconds. The best thing about condensed glue gel is a no wipe top coat. You can absolutely adjusting it as you go along. And if you need to add it more or is uh, more beads, more crystal, you can always do so. All right, here's 60 seconds. And then we're moving on to the last nails. And I have a super adorable, like, the skull right there. I'm going to do her hymns right there. Oh, my God. That is good, though. Let's see how long that will take us to do this fun design like this. It's only like 50 minutes well, with talking and stuff like that. Um, but if you're doing for one or two nails, it won't take you long. So you can't, like, including the queuing time. But uh, really, like, it's some fun nail art time. It doesn't take you that much. 
moving on the last nails i'm so obsessive with this so this is the right left right hand left hand okay so i am going to add the condensed gouge every time you're doing your enhancement crystal enhancement uh, I mean, crystal placement and designs always start with condensed blue gel first because that will change definitely your, is totally of your um, crystal placement. It will probably, your nails going to come off before any of the crystal will coming off. So be, uh, just be aware. <laughs> no white top gold. You can't just like peel it off or rub it off. You might be able to peel your nails off, but not the crystal. Ooh. That's going to be like concrete floating right on the top. And then we are adding this is like a rainbows, crystals, a school in there. It's just like, hey, I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to stay right under. All right. So add some pumpkin spice on. And that's about it. Wait a minute. And then add some beads in between. This pinky is so dramatic. Hey, I'm still in the form. Okay, so beads, beads, beads. This bead can go in here. And that's it. You can add more beads. You see, I finished the beads with on the end. And then, like, I usually doing, like, a triangle, like a pyramid. And add some, boop, just add a couple on. And this is really cool about this is going to glow in the darks when it chops in that. All right, done. Kia for 60 seconds. Just a little bit quicker right here. Best thing about this, you can adjusting it however you want until you're ready to kia. Okay, kia. Going to my favorite part, which is double, triple secure your crystal placement and this one which is precision glue gels i am just got from my subscription box this month november uh, i'm gonna put this back into my box because i can't wait to do more designs for you just really let you know that all the sub box is ready to ship thousand a thousand of them are waiting for a you to take it home and also if you sub it today you will get in like maybe a couple of days ship really fast okay so this is in glue gel in the box i get in this box so i'm so excited so we are going sub box <laughs> You are going to take off the uh, red cap. And here you go. And we're going to go into really details. This is the best thing. And I showed you earlier, it have the dual end. So the other end is a brush. And this end is a really detailed with the precise. You can see when you find a scratchy spot or if your ceiling is on the top of the metals, you are going to use little. You don't want to use it a lot. You can always go back and seal it over and over and over again. You don't want to flood it with too much precision glue gel because by the time you cure it, you don't want to look this like lumpy. You want to look your nail looks really nice and uh, flawless. So you seal good. And make sure that Kia flash Kia first. Check, check, check. Right here is in the spider's body right here. Check, check. If I have right here, I feel scratchy right here. 
So then clients will still feel like, oh my God, Nancy is scratchy right here. So when is the clients tell you what you feel right away with your clients? You, you only need to squeeze just a little bit that much. You see that how much is I squeeze it out? That's much little go a long way. You don't need to flood it, your crystal. I'm going to see on the top of the frame, a metal frame around top. Uh, to cover completely, prevent from getting tarnished because we're washing our hand. A lot of bleaching, cleaning, and a lot of hand sanitizer. You don't want all this like a metal piece will be turning tarnished. So, and I'm moving on the next one. Remember, I seal the top coat for this like skeleton hands and then also the um, Halloween's charm. But I'm going to seal it completely so then it's prevent from getting tarnished again and i'm going to check 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 along right here scratchy right here so every time you feel that you're going to squeeze just that much and look glitz love to support every single of you like everybody loved this so much and oh my gosh i wish it's going to be in next coming up sub box so we listen we able to seize all of your requirements comments we appreciate it and a lot of love and support and we are giving it it in this box so here you go again all right i know a lot of you have like whole museums of the glisper season glue gels i'm telling you never have enough never 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 ever so okay so moving on the next one, you see that how I seal, 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 seal. And then again, if you need to seal again, always coming back and seal again. I even seal this, this stone right here to make it even shinier. Not on the other stone, okay? Not on like crystal stone right here. Seal this, seal right in these edges, a little like uh, crystal skull right there skill i feel scratchy right here scratchy scratchy you're gonna squeeze it out just a little bit again always you can always come back and do more if you feel like you need you still feel scratchy okay so now we are going to care for 60 second completely full care for all the nails here you go and here's a here's a left hand and it's a right right and left all right i'm so excited with this you know thanks to the glitz november subscription box i'm still happy even though i don't have the um e-gift card but a lot of you get 100 of you will get the gift card so if you have it i would love to see your unboxing it's gonna be so excited and have fun all subscribers thank you so much for amazing love and support i have my i'm already like thrilled and happy even though i don't have an e-gift card uh, I thought I would have one in here for one dollars, but I didn't. <laughs> so it's okay. I still happy. So a lot of you will get it, and I'm so excited. Here I did use a lot of stuff. I use uh, the designs like this of my uh, leaf, like a fall leaf charms. I love that. It's absolutely stunning. And then I have like my funky sporty gels. I'm loving it. Uh, next tomorrow, I'm gonna use this one. And guess what happened? I'm gonna use for it too. I have so excited. I'm so excited. And then tomorrow, I'm gonna create this set for you. Okay, uh, using a sporty gel crystal too, but in the shorter nails. And this is the medium coffins from a gel on gel extension from Gliss. Stay tuned for it. It's the products will be dropping really soon and as i explained it earlier is that how flexible stronger and easier and it's like really light when you're wearing it and it lasts so long it's so easy for all diy as well as for the nail tech to achieve the clients as well so here is completely the whole set that i did you see that how it's so simple and easy i promise you will never go wrong with this all right, where am I? Right here. Hold on. Does that look good on under Instagram? Mm -hmm. All right, to all my love. Thank you so much, everyone. I have such a fabulous time with you today. Like three live videos. I want more. But the big boss said, uh, hello, it's time's up. You need to go back to work because you can't be here streaming all day long. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could be here streaming all along. Right, Mika? <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> is that right nancy i need to go back to work get back over here uh so, so okay i'll be back soon as long as uh as soon as i finding my red cap right here red cap and i want to say thank you so much this is our fourth year to doing is fall and halloween design it means a lot to us and every year is with each season and um a lot of uh creativities and then here's one of questions i will answer and uh, i will respond i forgot the name we're probably gonna shoot post it in there um where do i get all the inspiration and where do all of our brand ambassador get the inspiration from at first i have to say it's really it's really hard because uh for all of us for anyone who's really start with the journey it's gonna be so hard and to decide what you want to do it's only you need to do just be you and I just listen to my heart and every time I sit down, I know exactly what I want to share with you. And also all the inspiration come from majority from all of you, from a lot of excitement in the uh, Nails family. And then also is, is from my heart that every time I sit down, every single content I create is only a one of the purpose to want to bring it easiest, simple, quick easy so that everybody can enjoying it and if you are it's like learning some technique to take it to your business to the next level i'm so happy great to see that is every single of your achievement is definitely is my big rewards not only for myself and also for good success and such and our brand ambassador team thank you thank you so much for every single of you using their code uh, their code is not only to it just save you money also is really is supporting them for their throughout the journey because with continue your with your continue supporting they are able to create a lot of more content and bring it some more value content to really truly for a lot of you who loving is really cool nail text i mean nail art and a lot of creativity so thank you thank you so much for supporting always supporting glitz as well as our ba team um their inspiration come a lot from a lot of you and then they watching they seeing it what is really in trending out there they only try the best to really really is bring it to you so then you can stay on the top of trend and do not have to worry and afraid of um of any challenge at all and then you can go aggressive and bring the best to your business and bring it the best to your career okay so thank you so much and all the product you see i found it at glitz accessory and such and you can simply is find it in every single categories if you can't find this the products or you know specific items that you're looking for don't have to dm us well our team will be really like happy to assist you and also any question regarding to the shipment feel free to email us at info at .com. any other inquiries for the wholesale supplies uh for classes coming up for anything else uh, feel free to uh email us at info at .com. our team and office will able to uh, reach out to you asap okay thanks so much everyone and good luck with all subscriber and i can't wait to see who's gonna get a hundred dollars <laughs> it was just like i'm so excited all right everyone love you all please please be safe take good care of of yourself and your family okay i will see you in the next live video thank you don thank you mika thank you shabby thank you um who is that uh, laura's uh with the batch right mm -hmm. yeah thanks so much laura for the amazing batch thank you for supporting us thank you everyone on youtube facebook instagram twitch TikTok uh pinterest and all of the fam who is not a lot on social media or not active on 